Hey, what's up everybody? It's another day. Thank you for being there with me. Today, we're going to see how to create a multiple textures in just a single layer. See it. All right, let's jump in after effect and see how this thing get done. It's very easy and it's very useful. Okay, let's see in after effect. First of all, Let's just create a composition. Composition name you may even write whatever you like. I would like to write maybe source texty. This is my composition name and I'm leaving everything in the default. Okay, the color is not really matter. You may even select in whatever color you like, whether white or whatever, but I'm going for the black one. All right, press okay. And another thing, we're going to layer new text. Here the text, we are going to create the text. I'm just decided to go with the mission names, like uh, USA. I'm going to select the tool. I'm going to align my anchor point by, by placing Y in the keyboard. Take the anchor point at the middle of the text and then go to the alignment Select horizontal align vertical line. This is the exact at the center of my composition. All right. Another thing we are going to create a keyframe. Go to the layer, this US layer. Toggle down, and you see the word text. Toggle it down, you will see this word source text. Here is where magician take place. Okay. What we're going to do, just tap this stopwatch button to create a keyframe. Yes. And take your playhead after a couple of frames, like here, 12 frames. I'm going to highlight this word, this word I mean, and uh, by going to the selecting tools, highlight it and just change the word, word what, which word you want to put it here. Now it's a USA and the next word maybe it's a Canada, C-A, Canada. I'm going to repeat the same process as I, I use in, in, in US word. Okay, I'm going to press Y or you just go up here for the anchor point. Grab your anchor point at the middle of the word Canada. Go to alignment, align it at the center of your composition i hope we i made myself clear and then go to your timeline go to the text take your playhead after a couple of seconds again repeat the same process like go to the selecting tools highlight the word canada type another country maybe uh, china china Go to the selecting tools, go to press Y, take your anchor point at the middle of the word, go to alignment, select it horizontal, alignment on vertical, sorry, vertical. This is the exact the center of my composition. After a couple of seconds, I'm going back on my text layer right here. After a couple of seconds, I'm going to change this word again i'm i'm repeating the same thing so you can put as much as many words you want you can even change the color of the word in every in every word you change you can change the font you can do whatever like i'm going to change the word china i'm going to selecting tool highlight the word china I'll write another word maybe belgium belgium Belgium. I'm repeating the same process like go to the selecting tool, tap your Y in your keyboard, align it at the center, at the at the middle of your text, go to the alignment, select it horizontal, select it, align vertical, exactly at the center. You can repeat this process as much as how many words you want. Here I'm just going to show you by the three words, four I mean. Okay, let's preview and we see. Let me tap end to make end of my working area. 
let me preview them and see. Mm. I hope you came across with this kind of words, you see? You can, extra tip, you can even change the position of this text. If you want this USA to be at the center of this composition, and uh, after a couple of seconds, this word Canada, you want to appear at the corner of this of this composition, it's also possible. See, how are we going to do it? Just easy. Put your uh, play head at the first anchor point, go to the transform, tap this stopwatch on the position. When you make it your first keyframe, go to the second keyframe, the second keyframe of the source text, create the, uh, take the position of your, your word, where you want this word to appear. Maybe down there at the corner of my composition, right over there, right over there, right over there, yes. Yeah, this is the place I want this word Canada to appear. I also want this China also to appear at the center. What I'm going to do, I'm just selecting this, the first keyframe, command C for copying and command V pasting. That's the first keyframe. You see, it's just moving, it's easy. What we're going to do is just highlight this keyframe, click and go to the toggle hold keyframe. Tap toggle hold keyframe and you see, you never see the, that movement. You just find when the word Canada reach, you see appear at the center without seeing that motion. Let's preview and we see it. You see, huh, how amazing that. It's very easy and a very helpful tutorial. I hope you learned something. If you have a question, please don't forget to write something down there. And uh, by the way, don't forget to subscribe. This is a very, very young and new channel. Please, we need your support. We have a lot to learn. We have a lot to teach each other. Thank you very much for being there with me. Thank you. See you next time. Bye-bye. Don't forget to subscribe. Ciao.